hard a title shot to come by as there is in any UFC division is at 155 pounds. Here he is, the consensus number one lightweight title challenger, the number one contender, at least in terms of the rankings, getting set for a title fight here tonight. A lot of people think he is a live underdog in this championship setting. I guess we'll find out here, Joe Rogan. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic. And now our tail of the tape for this lightweight scrap. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. All right, just about ready to go here now for the particulars. We go inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffett. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. Well, what a championship outing it was for him the last time around, a win by knockout, and that really set this division on fire. A lot of people are paying attention to this guy right now. He is sort of creeping into the mainstream Conor McGregor style a little bit. We'll see if he can follow up that knockout with another one here tonight. That landed. All right, so let's see how the early portions of this fight play out. You know about the massive power he has in those kicks. He'll attack you low, he'll go to the head. Let's see if he can find the range here early in this matchup tonight. He, he landed a left hand there. Staying busy here in the clinch. Now goes to the knee to the body. Oh, a strong hook to the head there by Vic. He caught that one right on the knee. That could have hurt. Locks up the plum. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. There's a good knee to the body. Oh, he's got to be careful here. He's oh. hurt. He's hurt to the oh. body. Liver kick. Body kick. Oh. Oh. Wow. He's got him hurt here. He tagged him again. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Lands an outside leg kick there. Good punch. Well, he got cracked to the head there, Joe. He's gonna have to change things up here with his footwork, with his tempo. He continues to be vulnerable to that strike coming back. Gotta get his head off the center line. Just over two minutes to go in round one. That one hurt. And avoids the clinch. Nice jab. Vic gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. And he's got him up against the goal. Oh, Right under that right elbow. Wow. And that's gonna do it. Big roundhouse kick KO for the victory. Well, that was a no-doubter, Joe, and he's made a career of knocking guys out with kicks, but that one right there might have just been the best yet. Caught the opponent flush, full force, outstanding extension with the leg, and really, once he connected with the target, you knew the end of the fight was coming, and immediately his opponent goes to the canvas. A major, major result here in this division tonight. And here it is again. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. All right, let's go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the, the official the decision. This contest at three minutes, 18 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. Talking about those two words throughout fight week and new UFC champion. He